Hello there, I'm Aldra Hill, and this is Shortest Trip to Earth. Welcome to this interesting little game, FTL-inspired. Who does it like? A little bit of sci-fi exploration and probably horrendous death. We're going to start in Sector 1, the closest star. A warp drive malfunction has landed us in the wrong place light years away from Earth. We're almost out of fuel and supplies are running out. So we have to pick our lovely ship, and I almost broke my chair just there. The default name of Nuke Runner. We have a few ships to start out with. Um, small missile boat for intergalactic flights, and you see the individual stats of slots. Nuke, there's like nukes and weapons and accuracy and deflection. So we have the missile ship, the tigerfish utility frigate with industrial lasers and missile platform. Okay, this one that one seems. And then whatever the hell this is, a space eel ship. What? is this man what is this that's frightening let's go with the one that looks the most like an ftl ship that looks kind of cool that one just looks like a that honestly does look like an ng ship from ftl in terms of actual differences you get three more crew oh you actually got a lot more crew in the other one there's a lot less weapons as well like it's more evasion and deflection let's go with this one tigerfish okay we got our starting crew starting resources starting choose starting bonus perks Okay. Backup rations. All right. Starting bonus is 30% accuracy, 60% ship deflection, and 2% ship evasion. Fate points, 25. So I can pick up some points. Plus you fire safety drones. I haven't really played this game very much before, so I'm not 100% sure. This is a ship-specific perk. Each ship has done these. Tiger Paw repurposed industrial missile. An extra capital missile originally designed for breaking gigantic asteroids. All right. Pretty, pretty cheap. Nice. Oh, look, I get, a, I get a kitty. I get a kitty. I get a kitty. Okay. <laughs> Converted module that turns organics into synthetics. Ship specific ship reactor. Replaces ship reactor. Zero chance of malfunctions. Oh, I can see there's a lot of different changes here. Improves the ship's lasers. Improved lasers have double power requirement. Oh, we need more power. More ship. Can I get something that gives me more power? So I already have the reactor, so that's fine. Okay. An extra weapon module. A backup weapon assembled from spare parts. Backup sensor. A rat cook. Plus one crew rat, minus one exotics. And minus plus 30 organics. A rare coincidence allows us to recruit an excellent rat cook. <laughs> what? Alright. A small bot. I get an extra pet. A small pet drone. Knows vulgar words in all human languages. And draws fire. <laughs> fire safety drones. DOI repair drones. A gunnery. Oh, a gun operator drone. Okay, that's kind of cool. Extra credits, extra exotics. Let's get some uh, extra credits and some extra exotics. Why not? Provides med bay, drone repair module, synthetics. These are just, these are just like flat bonuses. Um, I will take that. And I need four. So let's get a repair drone. Boom. And then a backup weapon. Boom. Okay, cool. Let's do it. This tiger fish. Sounds good. It's, I really, I'm not sure the efficiency of what I'm picking, but we're going to figure it out. So my function ship's war drive landed us in a deep space, All right? Standard from all possibilities to refuel. I'm assuming the fuel for warp drive is separate than the fuel for propulsion. Our only option was to freeze ourselves and accelerate towards the closest star. Oh, Jesus. Oh. Five years later. Oh my God. That's kind of depressing, isn't it? All right, so where are we? We have mana, which is an organized star. We're here. This. Let's go here. Modules received from perks are currently inside storage. This planet is covered in ruins of a primitive, probably digital age civilization. Particular particle, particular crates on the surface indicate possibly the civilization might have wiped themselves out in a nuclear war. Analysis indicates possibility to scavenge various resources in the ruins. Then crew. I defroze our entire crew, I've assigned all of them to operate different ship modules. You might want to review this later. Ideally, our best operational work of shields and our best gunners could control ship weapons. I've completed calculating the shortest route. The journey goes through 10 sectors of uncharted space. Each of those sectors will contain an ancient one-way warp gate built by precursors before our time. Okay. Uh, the warp gates are usually controlled by the dominant faction of each section. We must convince whoever's guarding them to let us through. I marked the intergalactic warp gate of this system on our sector map. Try to explore every star system in the way to maximize our chances. Scavenging resources. Accident. A nuke 
nuclear detonation. I lost the crew. They triggered an ancient atomic bomb. <laughs> All right, that's that's wonderful. One of our interstellar on an system exploration drones discovered the nearby moon. It's an artificial structure. It's art active technology. Investigate. Under attack. God damn it. The structure proves to be a military complex of nuclear defenses. AI seems to be in full combat mode or crazy or both. Launched a full attack. We retaliated, destroying the base without much trouble. Salvaging the wreck building is hinted this was an automated military research base. Oh, cool. So we lost four ship hit points, gained a module, and a bunch of raw use, raw, raw d dust. D stuff. Okay. Click on a module. We have the incendiary cannon, which is broken. That is broken. So we do have point defense. The problem is I can only put it... Okay. Right. Can't really put it anywhere, because what I have is I have... Industrial laser, industrial laser, industrial missile platform, and industrial laser. I also have point defense, non-combat sensors, and two and tiger paw missile, two tiger missiles. Okay. I don't want to replace. Does it require any? Uh, it requires two synthetics per shot. All right, let's replace one of our lasers, I suppose. This one. Why not? Right. Unpack it. Cool. I also have industrial. I also have a tiger industrial missile, an improvised laser. So I don't think I should have taken that, but oh well. And a med bay DIY. So a multi container, which is storage capacity, fuel tank, warp drive, shield generator, energy generator, energy generator, bio sleep standard issue module storage container, an internal module slot. So let's put that there. Engine non-functional, cannot drive, no evasion bonus. Use the SOS beacon if no... Why is it not working? Doing a medical hygiene routine. Going to repair minor integrity damage. Okay. Their lovers cried. And then, bridge not functional, remote operation stopped ships can be driven by manually operating the engines so I do stuff per movement so this actual thing doesn't really matter okay so let's let's take a look so this is the the rat cook favorite cook is nut cake with fruit cream that is possibly a Star Trek Voyager reference that's not impossible to be a Star Trek Voyager reference. One of the things that Neelix, the head cook on the Voyager, and indeed Tuvok, when he gets his personality replaced in season five or six, he he makes Terran nut souffle, or Terran nut cake with a fruit cream. That's that's possibly a Voyager reference. If so, my God, that'd be a good one. All right, so I need to assign crew to everything. So where's my crew, like registry? Is there not a thing that just lets me see all my crew? Because that's kind of frustrating if I can't... Okay, there we go. Okay, so this guy is a repair drone. He's repairing stuff. And these are stats. So we have hand weapon skill, intelligence, gunnery. Okay, and then repair and movement and consumption. I assume intelligence dictates their operation skill. Yeah, can operate modules requiring the skill. Okay, cool. So the ones who have the highest... Thank you about alien sex. So, counting floor tiles, this guy should definitely be in the shield generator. Okay. This guy should be in the command bridge, which is a solitary command bridge, which is fine. Um, this guy should definitely be in the engine. Okay. Kind of annoying that I'm watching them move, like, I'm just waiting for them to move. Wouldn't it make more sense if they just click instantly? But oh well. I guess it'll be more important later on, right? Okay, this guy is Jane Seconds with an assault rifle. So they actually have a decent amount of skills. Gunnery, hand weapons, repair. Okay, so I want to make sure I put people with the, right, with the correct gunnery skill. Unfortunately, so operating, think about... Where are you? Ship repair officer, ship security officer, firefighting officer. 
So it would actually make more sense considering this guy's got more gunnery skill to put them on the industrial laser. Going to operate industrial laser. Good. Operating module, operating module. Thinking about rat empire. Operating module. I don't really have anything for this person to do. Going to operate warp drive. Good stuff. Kind of annoying that I lost a crew member already. And this lad will put over there. Okay. Um, away we go, right? I don't want SOS beacon. Alright, um... Planet with atmosphere ruins. Collect resources before entering the exit warp gate in the next sector. Where is the warp gate? Sector map shows you info about unexplored system and much more. I want to see an overview. Yes. We cannot see information about star systems outside our visual range. Sector view visual range, player ship icon, and these are the systems. Okay. And the fuel cost. Okay. So we need to get to one of these to go to the exit. So we need to go to northeast to Jubas. It's up there. They're pretty far. So let's go here. Mana 1. This gas jet has a thin layer of harvestable fuel elements. Harvests. Went as smoothly as possible. All right. Starting planets in this great planet grow enormous pods of oily substances, fruit. And also thinks the fruit oil can be processed into star fuel. So research and eco harvest fruit minus few synthetics or less. Ecological research and mass harvest. Research and mass harvest. Harvest complete. The harvest of the warp substance and the fuel was processed into star fuel. The operation involuntarily killed innumerable organisms. Oh, we just wiped out basically a planet. All right, cool. So we need to keep up our organics and fuel storage is pretty low. Lush forests and jungles cover this green planet and looks like a good spot for harvesting organics. Explore. It's easy here because locally the system is Earth-like and our harvesting technology means any adjustments. Equal opportunity to not click more than capacity. Yeah, let's get some organics. We lost five fuel. But we did get some Xeno data and a lot of food. So we can convert this to fuel. Nice. Travel! Oh, no, there's something there. Bunch of dead bodies drifting in space. Oh, we get to eat them. Mother AI thinks you're sexy. What the? F cool. Come to a thick layer of frozen carbon dioxide. Okay. I can't go to the star, obviously. Alright. I will harvest it and see if I can damage. And it took some damage, but I lost metals and synthetics. Damn it. It's kind of annoying. I can't really see. I need to go east. Oh, so I can just jump between. Oh, that's way easier. This goddamn traveling like an idiot. Okay. So, can I... What determines how much I can warp? Trust naked with them as a hobby. Small volumes of harvestable stuff. Estimate of attachment is below average. And smoothly. Alright, fuel. What's this? Whoa, hello. Fuel trader. Existential salutations, fellow consciousness. Let us trade forms of energy for mutual profit. Our fleet will be leaving the system after this meeting is over. This is truly a one-sided, once-in-a-lifetime situation. I don't know what any credits I have, though. Which one of these is credits? I could buy a hundred fuel. I'll buy a hundred fuel, then. Thanks for the trade. 
Oh, it's Xeno Bucks. Okay, include a small gift. The traders can get us a sculpture into plastic explosives. It is an accurate 3D model of how it would look like if a sculpture exploded. A truly unique piece of art, and they turn it directly into explosives. Large asteroids. Go on. Let's take a look. I'm gonna get hit, but a fast flying asteroid collided of our ship. At least had a mineral core or something. So we are getting kind of weak. Oh, we're low on food. Approaching ship. A medium sized and a small sized ship rapidly approaching tactical weapons range. Alien vessel, the star system is Rat Empire property. Oh, Christ. Uh, you have rat crew on board, and we shouldn't pay. You say you are a rat, but your ship not in the built in the rap empire. I'm in a good mood today, so I charge you half. Hell no. Prepare for battle. How do I fight? Okay, so it makes sense to try and hit the the weak the the that ship first, right? So let's um. So I want to try and be damaging their system. So their shield generator, if they have any, and their weapons. Nice. These guys have any point defense? Uh, energy reactor, warp drive, stealth detector, printed engine, energy reactor, incendiary cannon, rat. They have flak. Okay. Batteries. Let's just fire our missile on these guys. And then this uh, laser. Uh, they don't seem to have shields. Shield batteries. Ow, ow, ow. Nice. One of the hostages is charging with its war charge to escape the combat area. Might want to prevent them doing so. Who's charging up? I assume this one. Oh, wow, look at that fire. That's gonna, that's gonna die. Oh, do I only get like, how many missiles do I actually get? Nice, they're gonna die. Come on. Oh, we got him! He died. Uh, oh, this isn't firing. Oh, I gotta fire it every time? Boom! The battery's DIY destroyed. Salvage complete. Cool. Command bridge type solitary or micro reactor. Module repairs stop until you get more. Shh, no. I'm out of synthetics. Repairing well module costs 10 synthetics. So I'm out of that. What's, what got destroyed? Because I have a micro reactor. So I think I'm okay. So we'll just uh, store all. It seems the sector's been claimed by the Rat Empire. Greed the xenophobic mammals they are. Would you like to see a database? In yeah, sure. Let's see the civilization. It's organized as a system that's guaranteed social resource inequality. It's ridiculed and organizing everything into pyramidal hierarchies at highly praised. Okay. Let's take a look at our cargo. This should definitely be uninstalled. Because it is very broken. Um, let's put our laser back on there. There we go. Okay, back to the map. This planet is restricted to Gal Prospect Incorporated only. Failure to respect property boundaries results in orbital defenses. Try print long range missiles to neutralize the satellites or fight the satellites from a tactical dish. Uh, let's fire 20 explosives. We got plenty. We destroyed all the defenses. And you found a single large facility. Close inspection reveals it contains a single rapid cloning tube. Still nutrients in target genotype. Ah, activate it. Do some fuel, but. And we're under attack. The cloning machine does its thing and then stops to a loud screech. And it attacks our crew, and we just lost 30 fuel. There's mu- 
Wait, what? Much shouting confusion and chaos. Creatures out of shell was also protected by laser gun resistant reflective coating, directing some of our crew's handgun rays back to themselves. And finally, a precision shot finished it off. We got some organics, but lost metals. And a little bit of health. Could have been better. Could have been better. We're pretty low on organics. Nope, we already did this. Okay. Um, let's go to Mike. Let's go to Fleet. Oh, a shipwreck. A hack discovered all the shipwreck of a destroyer. Scavenge. Quality ECM system board the ship. Damage was still intact. And some metals. Nice. Uh, integrity. What is this? Integrity technology includes electronic countermeasures. Increases overall ship dodge and adds max HP points. I don't understand. Where, do I, where can I put it? Ah, oh, it's broken. Ah, oh, I can only go there. I don't have enough slots. Store off. You're low on organics. Eel trader. I will get some credits from exotic. Thanks to the business. Please set those consumables as a traditional token of our gratitude. Ah, they always give me extra stuff. It's organics. They are food, water, air, recreational substances. Okay. They recruit skills by 50%. Okay. I think they're frozen stuff. Awesome. Awesome. Uh, I guess let's just go here, I suppose. So I want to pick the ones that have the most planets on it, right? You were hit by an asteroid. You should get hit by fast flying asteroids. Uh, st st stay away from those things. Oh, I've been, like, damaged, haven't I? What's wrong here? Oh god, is it a fire? Put the fire out! I'm on fire! And we have no food. Put it out. Good boy. Losing the early crew messed me up. Oh man, that messed me up. Go to Nis. Okay. Go to space station. Want to get some tips about trade stations? They're a good place to sell resources for Xeno data. Some stations can also sell repair services, modules, and crew. It's cheaper to repair your shipping stations than manually by crew. You need extra Xeno data buy something because you're scrapping less useful modules. Right. Uh, buy star fuel. Sell it. Exotics. Alright, well, I can't... can't do any of these. Oh, I see how it works. Uh, I'll buy a little bit of fuel. We got quite a lot of credits, so it's alright. What exactly are our exotics, anyway? Oh, okay, recreational substances. Cool. Exit, and let's go over here. Oh, the hunger damage. Presence of life. Okay, explore. Cover of giant fungi. Eco harvesting is easy, because we can take the fruit bodies about killing the whole organisms. Eco harvest. Okay, soon after we send it, some of the local giant mushrooms start to glow and sing, emitting strong EMP-like waves to disable electronics. Shit. Thank you to investigate. And as our crew get closer, they feel a mild telepathic connection, establish the fungi vivid psychological images, and they understand this is how the fungi sees the world. Its roots cover the entire planet. It's connected to all beings. It wants food. Give. Well, I don't have 80. All right. Uh, bye. That was that was great. We're gonna starve to death. Oh God, what's this? I caught out a flock of warp eels. These beautiful creatures with their beautiful telepathic songs. Even passersby can hear. Hunt them. We were able to kill some of the beautiful animals and research their remains. 
They cried out telepathically when shot at, leading to some of the crew members offering the guns, exercising their universal non-aggression rights, refusing to carry out the shooting order. Whatever. Pansies. We had we needed food, man. Oh, Desolate Sand, but we found a military ship. Scavenge. Let me scavenge materials. We're gonna live. For now. Approaching ship. If open channel. Alien vessels to star system is rent empire property. All alien vessels must pay their vis property visiting tax. We shouldn't pay. I will prepare for battle. Let's go, boy. Okay. Once again, pretty easy. Imperial Gatling gun. Oh, oh, I see, I see. I have made a whoopsie. No, this is this is very much a whoopsie. Yes. Oh dear. Um, that's an incendiary cannon. Okay, let's 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 get. Let's break their shield batteries. They got a flak cannon. They got flak. Oh dear. Let's try and burn their weapons. And let's get these guys over here to blow up their their stuff. Why is this online? Offline? Turn it on, Jesus! Ow! One of the hostages is charging on its war drive. Yeah, we're winning. Nice. Ow! 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 Um, let's go to their war drive. Nice! We got him! We're on fire. You guys, uh, damage their, their weapons. Beautiful. Doesn't do a lot of damage. Oh, that's on fire. That's on fire. Please put that out. Put that out. No, no, put it out. Salvage complete! Ah, oh, look at all those resources! Oh, get the hell out of here. Non-combat sensor. Improved st system sensors. Oh, hell yeah. Nice. Slot damage. Oh, this is cool. I like this. This is interesting. Yeah, I know. I've seen them. I've met them before. All right, back on warp drive. Pretty good stuff. We won! We fe we beat the first section. Uh, let's explore the area first. Investigate, as long as you don't all goddamn die. Well, the sand structures is an artificial. It's a hidden entrance to the network of underground caves. And our recon drones have been attacked by local cave life, and they killed my drones. It's an assault team! Combat report. We checked on the pack of aggressive predators. They were powerful and deadly, but no match for advanced weapons. Food. Ah, oh, resources. And a failed bug. Whoa! Let your survival city full of dead humanoids. Bug has been, uh, been overrun by predators we met earlier, but no survivors remain. We scavenge everything of value. Look at that! Tons of resources. We've got a mini growery. Bioengineered plants. Turn synthetics into rapidly consumable organics. Nice! They're very useful if I start to run out of supplies. This is really cool, man. Let's let's go all the way around the map first. Before we get to the warp drive. Of a small station orbiting this otherwise uninteresting planet is sending a traitor signal. Whose credentials are unknown. Dock with the traitor. They're exclusive rivers to junk except for a shady pair of kichankis. A five-barreled mining laser for dirt cheap. Buy the weapon. Dishonest trader. It has five barrels. The fifth one doesn't do anything except increase power consumption. Ah. Mining laser four degraded. Let's compare it. HP, uh, 10. Reload time, 12. It's got four shots. Ah, oh, man, it's not as good. Well, this is just poopy. Compare them. So higher loading time, less accuracy. It's it's just it's worse. All right. 
Scrap. Scrap it. I'm starting to pick this up. I'm picking it up. What's this? What you got for me? A fuel trader. I will buy 100 fuel for 166 credits. Thank you. A ship carcass. Carcass of a fuel tanker looted to the bones. Most likely the work of pirates. Collect fuel. No incidents. Nice. Let's see what this is. Ow. 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 And now we're on fire. Is anyone going to put out the fire? Buddy. Put out the fire. I thought we had a repair drone. I guess I need a crew to be able to just, uh, calm it down, right? Hey! Oh my god. Stop lighting me on fire! It's very irritating. Do I need to have someone on the warp drive at all time, or can I just have him putting things out? There we go. Okay. Modules! I don't want any of these, but they're definitely cool. No crew, unfortunately. Mark all damage. Nice. That's extremely expensive. Holy shit. Oh, it's beautiful. And a little bit of, uh... A little bit of organics as well. Delicious. Exit the warp gate! As long range warp is warp to rent empires which to pass must pay them. Those questions imperial will serve and also be executed and I have a nuke. Pay the tax. Attempt to bribe with exotics. Your rules. Uh, inspire me to question them. Prepare for battle. Okay. He's, he's trying to attack me, isn't he? Wow, that's a that's a big laser. Okay, rat flak, long range sensor, rat flak. Oh wow, look at all these rat flags. Shield emitters, shield batteries. Okay, let's let's see if we can focus everything on the shield batteries first, and then I don't know, not on that uh, on that capital launch missile tube. They shoot it down. Oh, they're on fire. Receive critical damage. Critical damage tokens may cause explosions or fires. Wow, okay. No, this is... Oh! Oh, this is horrible. That's offline. Wait, what? What's happening? Attacking? Wait, what? Oh god, we've been boarded! We've been boarded! Oh, he died! What? No! My kitty! My kitty! <laughs> it's up to you with your shotgun. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Please don't die. He, he died. Is everyone dead? I think I've lost. Where's the rest of my crew? Where is he? And we died. Okay. Well, that was fun. I think it was good. I'd like to play this more. I might play it on stream as well. Do be sure to leave me a like and a comment on this video and go check out the game as well if you're more interested in seeing it. Uh, this is pretty silly, but I do like it. I was Alex. I'll continue to be and this has been Shortest Trip to Earth. Bye-bye.